What's up guys, welcome back to another vlog. This is how my <laughs> this is how my Sunday looks like. So currently it's half time and I think we are winning by 3-1 so that's good I still have 45 more minutes to go but I'm already gassed out but I'll probably finish the probably finish the game later on with 45 minutes to go hi ref Okay, coming, coming, coming. Woo! Gabriel Jesus! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go and join them. So, this is human trafficking after football. <laughs> da da da! <laughs> We have the whole team in a van. <laughs> All right, coming in, guys. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Squeeze. Squeeze. <laughs> Oh. Hi. So, yeah, I've been trying to do this vlog for a long time but never really happened uh, due to the fact that, you know, I get to the game. Everyone is very, very shy when it comes to, you know, when you whip out a camera and they just started not being themselves. And yeah, all the footages I have, it doesn't look great. Um, it's just really awkward. So I never really post it, but I've been trying to, you know, um, share like my Sunday ritual. So basically, basically, I think this one, I think, I'm not sure for, I think every guy who plays football can resonate with it. And yeah, I just want to post it as a memory, memory purposes, and especially for Burmese guys who play football. And I just realized there are like 30 over teams, 30, 30 Burmese over teams, like in Singapore which is just crazy one team will have like 26 players and it's just mind-blowing how many Burmese guys are here in Singapore anyway yeah just want to make this like a, a post a ritual um, I mean a memorable post because yeah we do this every Sunday and this is half of our day is just you know with all the a bunch of guys and yeah talking about our work like freely you know never really have to you know care no boundaries like you know like nothing to there is like nothing for you to you know really think about or like whether you know should i say this or should i not and yeah it's just something that is away from work and something the energy is just there you know everyone come together for the thing that we love which is football and yeah it's just incredible um that's just like a few clips of like what you see in front just like a few clips of um how we you know go about every sunday so yeah it's just a time where you know stress-free no matter if we lose the game I mean if we lose the game we make fun of it and then we joke about it but if we win a game it's a good feeling today we won 4-3 and yeah it was just incredible and yeah so this vlog is totally random but I just wanted to share with you guys um, 
this is like the happy day for every one of us I think every guy out there give like half of their day half of their day literally half of their day since like 12 when you know after lunch we are already excited to go to and this happens every week and we don't get you know sick of it we might change our girlfriend you know, we might change what we eat we might change like a lot of other things but surprisingly i've been playing with this team for the past eight to ten years and yeah it's just it's just incredible that you know this thing haven't stopped and no matter like if there's like a new teammates old teammates old guys you know young guys it's just a, still the same feeling and yeah after after travel we really have a good talk so yeah this is one day that i look forward to every week so yeah i'm just happy to share with you guys anyway um thank you guys so much i appreciate every single one of you uh and i'll see you guys in the next vlog if you guys stick stick around until this period until this part of the video i just want to say like you know thank you thank you so much and because i haven't been doing great vlogs ever since i came to singapore haven't really been exploring that much <clears throat> Um, so I've been working part-time I've been you know looking for clients looking for what's that looking for a full-time job per se and yeah it's it's kind of stressful here out here because money is a big deal and for a small creator like me um, yeah wish I'm not earning that much on YouTube money is a big thing you have to pay rent you know you need to figure out you know what to eat and yeah everything here is expensive this is like the most expensive Singapore is like the most it is a most expensive city to live in so you can imagine right I can't just be you know freely vlogging and having my thoughts and you know going full in for content creation I wish I could if I'm back in Myanmar probably could and yeah probably should have but yeah like I said in the previous vlog if you want to know the reason why why you can check check out that vlog anyway yeah haven't been really you know creating proper content like I'm, I'm not liking the things that I put out there and yeah hmm I don't know maybe I'm not even gonna maybe I might not even put this up you know but anyway we'll see we'll see yeah that is that so thank you again for all the support even though my vlogs have not been up to the quality I want I've been getting like you know seriously like how I don't know who's watching it but yeah weird views weird numbers but thank you not complaining <laughs> so yeah that's that it that is it um thank you guys so much again bye guys